Hello everyone, in this video we're going to talk about three recording devices. This one here is the digital video recorder. This one here is the network video recorder. This one here is the PoE network video recorder. These three video recorders have some similarities. Like they all can record videos of course, and they can all install a hard disk drive for massive recording and long term recording. Also, we can use a VGA or HDMI to connect a screen with the recorders and we can watch our live feed videos. After talking about the similarities, let's talk about some differences they have. This one over here, the digital video recorder, it usually connects with analog cameras. The analog camera sends back the video feed in analog signals and analog signals cannot be directly written on the hard disk drive it has to be converted to digital signals first but don't worry the video recorder has that function so it will just uh, transfer it to itself and then write it on the hard disk drive then let's take a look right here in the middle this one here is our network video recorder the network video recorder it usually connects to IP cameras the IP cameras send the signal back as digital signals so it can just be directly written on the hard disk drive. Although you have to know that if you want to watch the video feed, it has to be decoded back to analog signals. Well, DVRs don't have to do that. Now let's take a look right here. This is the PoE NVR. What's so special about the PoE NVR is because it has the PoE switches features built into it. You can take a look at the back right here, the PoE switch ports right here. So when we use this as a video recorder, we don't have to get an extra PoE switch and all the ports will send power and data from the NVR to our terminal device like our IP cameras. So this is kind of convenient and also it has including the recording features, this and that. Now after we've discussed all the difference and similarities, how should we choose which recorder we use? Well, if we have analog cameras, no, one, no, no doubt we're going to choose the digital video recorder. And if we have like IP cameras, how do we choose between these two? Well, there's actually, if you have like a giant video IP camera system, it's best for you to choose the uh, network video recorder because this one provides more mobility. You can use a PoE powered switch to expand the PoE network. Like if you have a PoE power switch in the field, you can connect the PoE power switch back to the video recorder and then it, the PoE powered switch will work as a PoE switch in the field. So then your, your PoE network is expanded. But if you have like only a several, like two or three cameras in the system, you can choose the PoE power, the PoE network video recorder. This, cause since it's PoE switch is built inside, it saves more space, it's more efficient, and it's, the size is smaller, so it, you know, it doesn't take up a lot of places in your, wherever you set it up. Well, that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, please post them at the section below. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.